As a former active duty Army officer myself, I appreciate the sacrifice that so many of you have made, but truth be told, I can't begin to appreciate the sacrifice that some of you have made and your families have made and those that so many of you served with have made, some the ultimate sacrifice. It was 74 years ago on this date when there was the invasion at Normandy. The President Franklin Delano Roosevelt came on the radio and gave an address to the people of the, United of the United States. These were some of the words that he shared. Almighty God, our sons, pride of our nation, this day have set upon a mighty endeavor, a struggle to preserve our republic, our religion, and our civilization and to set free a suffering humanity. For these men are lately drawn from the ways of peace. They fight not for the lust of conquest. They fight to end conquest. They fight to liberate. They yearn but for the end of battle, for their return to the haven of home. Some will never return. Embrace these, Father, and receive them, thy heroic servants, into thy kingdom. And for us at home, help us, almighty God, to rededicate ourselves in renewed faith in thee in this hour of great sacrifice. With thy blessing, we shall prevail over the unholy forces of our enemy. And America did prevail because of people exactly like you. Again, we owe you such a debt of gratitude. I'm personally grateful. As a veteran, as an American, as a father, as someone blessed to have been raised in the land of the free and the home of the brave, thank you. Thank you for your service, for all that you've done for America.